Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Capricorn Goddess. This reading is going to be for my Leo. So if you are a Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, this reading may resonate to you, Leo. Let's go ahead and tap in Leo and see what's going on with my Leos. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what messages do you have for my Leos at this time? What messages do you have for my Leo? Messages for my Leo. We have right action. It says literally means let everything that wants to go, go. And everything that wants to come, come, Leo. Okay. Messages for my Leo. Outrageous openness. Dear love, open me to your will. Release me from my attachment, surprise, and delight me with your plan. You know what's needed, and I am open to receive. So, Leah, what I'm getting from these is, Spirit wants you guys to be open to receive what he wants to bless you with. I feel like some of you guys had some sort of attachment that you couldn't let go. The Spirit is saying that whatever this is, if it wants to go, go. Whether it's a person, place, thing, whatever. If it wants to go, let it go. And if someone wants to come towards you, let them come. Okay? But whatever this is, Spirit is wanting you guys to be open to receive whatever he wants to bless you with, Leo. Let's go ahead and tap in for my Leo. Spirit, what messages do you have for my Leo? Some of you guys could be attached to something or someone. Let's see. Yeah, somebody has a grip on something. Spirit, what messages do you have for my Leo? We have the Seven of Cups. Queen of Swords. We have the King of Cups. What else for my Leo? We got the Two of Swords. We have the Higher Feet. Could be dealing with the Gemini, Libra, Aquarius could be dealing with the Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or a Taurus, Libra. We have two of Pentacles. We have the Empress, Leo, at the bottom of the deck. There could have been a masculine energy here juggling two women. Could have been this Empress. And the Queen of Swords. There could be a masculine here that had other options as well. I'm picking up two women, the Empress and the Queen of Swords, and I'm picking up with this Seven of Cups. There could be a masculine here that had several options. This person could have been married as well, or just in a committed relationship. I feel like this person juggled a lot. Out of control, this person, whoever this masculine is, this king of cups, they try to act hard, but I feel like this person is extremely emotional. But I feel like this person doesn't show his true feelings either. This could be you, Leo, or someone you're dealing with. We have the Queen of Wands. So this is you, Leo. This is your fire sign energy. What is the Queen of Wands? Someone's extremely attractive here. Yeah, it's two women here. I can't make it up. And a masculine, King of Pentacles. Could be dealing with the Earth sign. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. There you go, Leo. I feel like someone do want to be happy here. Their happiness is dependent on, and I don't like this, but I'm going to say it because that's what I'm hearing. 
their happiness depends on who they choose to love them. It's two women here. It's another fire sign here, and there's an air sign here. Queen of Swords and the Queen of Wands. There's a masculine here that can't choose between two women. Yeah, Ten of Cups. This could be a poly. This could be a polyamorous relationship, or this masculine wanted to be. Ten of Cups. Wow, so is there a masculine here that wants to be a family with two women? Yeah, five of ones. This masculine could have two women fighting over him. We got the King of Cups, Queen of Cups, Nine of Pentacles, Four of Cups. We got the King of Cups here. This masculine can have a twin flame because we got counterparts here. There's someone here matching this uh, masculine's energy, but I'm picking up. He, it's two, three women on this table. We got the Knight of Swords. That's fast forward movement. is Leah. All I know is there's two women here. This masculine been giving six of pentacles to two women. Yep, this person has been investing in two women. Judgment. Now this person is being blocked and forced to make some sort of decision here with these two women. There's a third party here. Let's see what this is. Spirit, what messages do you have for my Leo? There could be a Leo feminine or a Leo masculine. Take it as it resonates. Somebody is juggling two women, two men, whatever. Take it as it resonates. We have the Queen of Pentacles, so someone's dealing with the Earth sign, Can, uh, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. There's someone here that also has childhood issues, so this is probably why this person juggles, because they have childhood issues. There's some sort of trauma here. Could be sexual trauma. It says, money is coming your way. Have patience. So, Leo, if some of you guys have been Waiting on finances. Spirit is asking for you guys to have patience at this time. There's some sort of major change going on here. Sagittarius, you could be going through. Or you could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Someone's going through a transformation here. As well. We have the Empress here again. We have She's Not the One for You. So, if you are a Leo masculine, there's somebody here on this table, whether it's a Queen of Wands, it could be a Queen of Swords. So, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. We got Leo. Leo. Yeah, there's some jealousy and envy here. Someone is trying to block your forward movement, Leo. So this could be you, Leo, trying to block somebody's forward movement. Or somebody could be trying to block your forward movement. We have she's not the one for you and he's not the one for you. So with this decision, there's a woman or a man here that's not the one for somebody here. It says, I hate the way I treated you. Now it's too late to apologize. So... You take it as it resonates to your story, Leo. I just know that it's a masculine here with two. Let's see. There's a masculine here with two women. One is the Empress. One is not. Let's see. This masculine can have options. 
Somebody here has options. Spirit, what message is? Okay, we got the Eight of Wands, Leo, and the Sun. This is your energy. So, Leo, you could be receiving some sort of communication from someone, or you're going to be communicating with someone. Could be a Capricorn. We got the Devil in the Chariot. You may want to go towards a Capricorn, Leo, or a Capricorn is coming towards you, Leo. Somebody could be obsessed with someone here as well. We got the Nine of Swords. So somebody's stressing, worried, having anxiety because they feel left out in the cold by someone. Take it as it resonates, Leo. But whatever this is, Spirit wants you to let whatever this is go and whatever wants to come, come. We have the page of one. Somebody wants to talk to you, Leo. Or you want to talk to somebody. But there's two women here. We got the Queen of Pentacles again. And the Queen of Swords. I can't make it up. It's two women here. There could be a masculine in love with two women. Or two women are in love with this masculine. This is real messy. What else for my Leo? Yeah, Eight of Cups. Somebody's walking away though. One of these women is what I'm picking up may walk away. Yep. The Empress. Six <laughs> so that's who walking away. The Empress. We had an Empress out here twice. The Empress not going for this. The Empress is no longer giving to something here. What is the Empress in the city? Somebody wants the Empress. Yeah. Seven of Swords. Someone's been lying on this Empress. Let's see what this Seven of Swords is for Leo. I ain't playing on Leo reading to be this long. The Hangman. Someone was trying to hang on to this Empress energy. So, there was a masculine here with two women. He knew one of them was his counterpart. Or he knew one of these women were the empress, the real empress. He's watching this person because I feel like the, the empress left this person. Yeah. The empress not going to be juggled. Yeah, this is a third party. I can't make it up. Three of cups. The empress left. And decided to be single with the Nine of Pentacles. And she is getting ready for her new beginning. Ace of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Two of Cups. Yep, her intuition told her. Let's see, Leo. This is too much for my Leos. Spirit, what messages do you have for my Leos? Messages for my Leos. Real messy. I'm picking up heavy third party energy for my Leos. Ooh, okay. So, okay, Leo. Mm, I got a stretch on that one. So, first card out same sex relationship. So, there could be a Leo masculine that. Is in a same-sex relationship as well. Not only is he juggling two women, but I feel like this person has other options of women in me. Okay, what is this? But he's obsessed with someone. Now, someone is obsessed with this masculine. There's a gay masculine here or a bisexual masculine here. Yeah, lies. I'm having lots of regrets. I didn't mean to hurt you. We just got that in what? Taurus reading, I think. Some of you guys could be dealing with the Taurus. We have legal issues. So, uh, Leo, this could be you or someone you're dealing with that has legal issues. About my money right now. So if someone's focusing on their money due to some sort of legal issues. Losing my mind over you. And waiting on a call or a text from you. I said somebody wanted to talk to you, Leah. 
or you want to talk to somebody, Leah, take it as it resonates. Somebody wants to talk to you, Leah. Could be an Aries. What messages do you have for my Leah? We have daddy seeing lovers. Could be a Gemini. This could be a lover. You make me feel like I can trust. So, Leah, you make this Gemini or this Aries feels like they can trust you or you feel like you can trust them. But be careful, Leo, because this could be someone that has you in some sort of delusional energy, Leo. But somebody wants to talk. I might name that. Can we talk, Leo? Somebody wants to talk. Somebody stalking you or you're stalking someone. And he says, I want more than sex. Let's get some messages from your person before we go, Leo. What messages do you have for my Leos, Holy Spirit, Holy Angel? There is a third party. I knew that. I was picking that up. There's two women, possibly men here. Somebody has third parties. I have sexual fantasies about you. So this person sleeps around. But they're having sexual fantasies about you, Leo, or you're having sexual fantasies about someone. I'm not ready. I feel you. So this person definitely feels your energy or you feel theirs. I feel empty without you. You make me want to be a better person. So this is a, I'm thinking of this is a promiscuous man who don't know what he want, basically. Soulmate. This, this masculine could have already met their soulmate. I pull away because I am overwhelmed, overwhelmed with all of the things going on in my life. And you are the love of my life. So, yeah, I'm just picking up on a confused man, basically, is what I'm picking up. So, take this message, Leo, as it resonates to your story. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Um, at this time, Leah, I'm not doing personal readings, but I am going to continue to put out the content until I do open my personal readings back up, and I will let you guys know. I'll keep you updated on that. Until then, feel free to um, donate to the channel for more um, tools for the channel. They're highly appreciated if you do. I only have a cash app right now, so I will put that in the description box below, Leo. Take care, Leo.